Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another solid video. My name's Henry. This is my channel, Classy Sense. And today I will be making it about you ladies out there. I will be giving you my five favorite sexy perfumes that I love to smell on a woman, All right? So if you're interested in my list and to see what I have to offer, keep it right there. Welcome back guys. As you can tell, this video is for you ladies out there who are looking for the next big thing when it comes to perfumes. And if you're interested to see what perfumes that I find sexy on a woman. So before I dive into this list, I'm gonna give you two honorable mentions that clearly didn't make the cut, but are still sexy enough to be purchased or to have in your collection. So my first honorable mention is Pink Sugar. Opens no. up with some cotton candy vibe some caramel some vanilla yes it is very very sweet and i feel like it's more suitable for the teenagers now if you're the ages between i say 16 on to the mid 20s this is very, very suitable for you if you're in high school or in um, a freshman in college this is absolutely a great fragrance pink sugar my first honorable mention all right my second honorable mention is another solid hitter for you females now the only reason why it is an honor an honorable mention because it is yet too popular and it's from the house of dolce gabbana and it's none other than light blue this fragrance is very very good very well rounded great for the summer and for the springtime but it is a little yet too popular a lot of females out there own this fragrance and they're um, collection this is still an amazing fragrance opens up with some Sicilian lemon and some apple and it has it does have some bamboo in here this is very bright very citrusy with a little bit of hint of musk at the dry down Dolce Gabbana light blue that's it for my honorable mentions let's go ahead and dive into this list coming in at number five kicking this list off is from the house of Marc Jacobs and this is none other than decadence yes I'm not a fan of the, the bottle or the packaging, but other than that, this fragrance is beautiful. I feel like it is upscale, it is rich. The quality of this fragrance is absolutely stunning. Now, I feel like it's not that versatile. It's more suitable if you're heading to the office or you're dressed up and your fashion is yet upkept. This will go well with you i absolutely love this fragrance and my wife likes to wear this on date nights or when she's heading out to the office very very sexy and one of my top five favorite fragrances for you females decadence by the house of mark jacobs all right ladies coming in at number four is a sexy seductive close encounter fragrance and it's from the house of juicy couture and this fragrance is absolutely sexy ladies i purchased this fragrance about a week and a half ago and the performance is not all that great. Yes, as a fragrance reviewer, I love to test out all type of fragrances, even female fragrances from spraying them on my wrist to see what they have to offer in the um, performance category or whatnot. And my wife usually gets around five to six hours of longevity and it projects around one to two hours and then becomes very, very close to the skin. That's why I feel like this fragrance is more of a close encounter fragrance. When you're about to have a cuddle session with your man or whatever the case is, this will take the cake. I absolutely love it. I think it's sexy. I think it's seductive. It is up fruity due to the kiwi and that the dry down you get a little bit of florals working its way in very smoothly absolutely sexy can't get enough of this juice always love when my wife wears this fragrance i think it's seductive and this is a fragrance to keep in your collection if you're a juicy couture fan all right ladies coming in at number three is a personal favorite of mine it is very sexy very versatile and it i do not my wife doesn't own a bottle of it the house of victor and rolf and it's none other than flower bomb I do. She has actually two decans that um, a friend actually hooked us up with and she fell in love with it. This perfume is absolutely gorgeous. I absolutely love when my wife wears this fragrance. It is versatile. You could dress it up, dress it down, wear it to work. Very, very sexy. It has patchouli, tea, orchid. You can get the patchouli in the opening, but it's not like all up in your face. It is very smooth. And the white floral and this juice is absolutely gorgeous. 
I am telling you right now that this fragrance is absolutely sexy. At number three, Victor and Rolf Flower Bomb. At number two, YSL Black Opium. This fragrance wasn't love at first sniff. I smelt it at the top. I wasn't a fan of it. My wife tested it on her wrist and I picked it up later on. I thought it was gorgeous, gave it a chance, bought it for her quickly became one of my favorite female fragrances now this is like the original but with more of a dark edge to it i feel like it can become an all season all year long fragrance if you know how to wear it and know how to use it on your skin very very sexy seductive versatile fragrance can dress it up dress it down but my, like my wife she prefers it when she's dressed up on date nights it has a little dark edge to it I feel it is sexy and it is seductive. You have vanilla, coffee, pear, pink pepper, woods, and patchouli that make this wonderful, wonderful fragrance. This is a fragrance that, again, took some time for me to get used to, but as soon as I got used to this juice, I absolutely love it. At number two, by YSL Black Opium. All right, ladies and gentlemen, coming in to my last fragrance this is a classic fragrance been around for a while now man home run hitter i smelled this fragrance at dillard's thought it was beautiful at number one from the house of chanel and it's none other than coco mademoiselle a very great versatile sexy upscale fragrance godly guys this fragrance is absolutely sexy i feel like any age can pull this off you could dress this fragrance up, dress it down, but this is another fragrance that presents itself with class. It is rich, it has great quality. So I feel like this works better if you dress it up to the office on a date night, presents itself with class like I just stated. Absolutely wonderful for release from the House of Chanel. One of my favorite Chanel perfumes, one of my favorite designer fragrances for you females absolutely love this stuff opens up with some patchouli and some orange has some mandarin orange going in as well some vanilla this fragrance is absolutely wonderful guys very very sexy and an upscale fragrance from the house of chanel and coco mademoiselle at my number one spot there you have it ladies my top five sexy perfumes to smell on a woman and two honorable mentions. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it and I enjoyed sharing this list with you guys. So that does it for this video. I appreciate each and every one of you for stopping by and taking the time out of your day to check out this list and to see what I have to offer. So hopefully if you're new to this channel, you subscribe for future videos. And if you've been with me for a while, click the bell button to be notified when I have contact up and running. So I will see you on the next video, the next top 10. But until next time, like always, stay classy, smell good. Peace.